It's a lightweight bout between Do Hope Choi and former Strike Force champion Gilbert Melendez. Gilbert Melendez, who for years has been amongst the elite in mixed martial arts. He was 11-1 during his days in strike force, earned the lightweight championship on two occasions. Always willing to stand in the middle of the octagon and trade, he's a Brazilian jiu-jitsu black belt under Caesar Gracie. Gilbert El Nino Melendez. Gilbert Melendez, the former Strike Force lightweight champion, is one of the elite of the elite at 155 pounds. He has outstanding cardio, devastating knockout power, excellent wrestling, and success over top notch fighters. Whole Troy, as always, very well prepared, extremely focused, and ready to go to bat. This guy has great conditioning, Mike. His teammates all talk about the work he puts in in the gym. He is just a cardio machine. He never seems to get tired. And one thing we can count on is that the deeper this fight goes, the more the odds are going to swing in his favor. Duho Choi, set to fight, Gilbert El Nino Melendez. Our tale of the tape for this lightweight collision. Choi is 32, Melendez is 41. He will have a three inch reach advantage. And once again, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC lightweight division. Introducing first, fighting at the blue corner. A mixed martial artist holding professional record of 39 wins, 15 losses. He stands 5 feet 9 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of San Francisco, California, Gilbert El Nino Melendez! And now he's busy his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 23 wins, no losses. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting at a groovy South Korea, the Korean Super Bowl, Do Ho Choi. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. Herb Dean, our referee for this Ready, lightweight fight. collision. Ready. And we are underway. Three-round fight. White Joe, oh, he's taking some punishment here early, Joe. Big straight punch. Oh, oh, he's landing. He connects with the head kick. Solid jab. Boy, he is swinging for the fences. Big leg kick land. Good combinations. Oh, and another jab. Oh, nice. Vicious knees. There it is. Got the takedown. And he turned it around into full guard. Not much going on, Joe. Yeah, this is a stalemate here. They seem to be canceling each other out. Or they're both taking a little bit of a breather. Choi with a punch that connects. Choi's got it back in half guard now. Nice shot to the head. Wow, quick movement on the ground. Now falls back into guard. Man, you can see the effect of those punches that have landed because his left eye is really starting to close up. 
Two minutes remain in this round. Troy with a knee to his leg. And they break free. Full side control in half guard. He's got full guard here. He keeps busy from the bottom. Postures up here. Final minute of round one. Half guard now. Right into guard again, though. Nice movement on the ground. Troy with a hook from the clinch. Troy gets the takedown late in the round. He's got the full mount, Joe. And great posture. And the round comes to a close. And what a statement he made with that takedown. All right, let's take a look at some of the action here. Here's a huge kick that stuns. Here's a nasty head kick that lands. And here we see excellent timing with this trip. Great round. All right, listen to me. Breathe. Deep breath into that nose. Out to that mouth. All right, perfect round. I need you to go out there and do more of that. Now, I want you this round to look to improve your power. And the lovely Brittany. You ready to fight? Ready. Round two. He's definitely going to want to start this round off fast to try to pick up where he left off. His opponent was in big trouble at the end of that round. That jab is lightning fast. He's really doing a good job of controlling distance and getting oh off these my, shots. He, he is in big trouble here. Beautiful body shot there, too. Oh, he sweeps. Look at his position now. And the clinch. And they disengage from the clinch. That left misses. Joe, good kick by Melendez. Look at that, he's timing that jab. Oh, good connection by both men. Gilbert Melendez is continuing to attack that bad eye. He certainly is targeting it, and the more that eye swells, the less his opponent's gonna be able to see the punches coming. Joe, we're seeing some nice work. He's really staying busy. Melendez with a hook to the body. That swelling on his eyes is really starting to get bad. Good kick to the leg of his opponent. Excellent job of timing these combinations. Good takedown defense. And they move out of the clinch. Oh, he lands the roundhouse to the body. He caught him with the head kick. Hard straight punch. Big left hand. Putting on a show here. Big uppercut to the head. Oh, head kick. How good is this? Oh! He blocks that vicious knee. Nice jab by Melendez. Just under a minute on the clock here in the round. Good straight punch. Nice knee. Misses the takedown. Oh, he caught him. He has been landing that uppercut at an alarming rate. You're absolutely right, Joe. He's doing an awesome job, continuing to score with the uppercut. Good job of timing strikes here. 
Man, he's being tested, but he's back up. Oh! Another big shot to the head by Troy. Knee to the body by Gilbert. Wow! Oh, he hurt him. He hurt him bad. Oh. And ahead to round three. Gilbert Melendez is lucky to still be in this fight. He was saved by the bell. He got cracked at the end of that round. That wasn't that big of a shot. You can take that. All right, we'll be fine, we'll be fine. All right, next round. Here's a huge punch that stuns. And here's a powerful shot that almost ends this fight. And here it is from a different angle. The lovely Ariani here tonight inside the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas, Nevada. Ready to fight. Ready. Five Ready. minutes left in the fight. Melendez gets caught by the kick to the midsection. Hit him with a jab. Softening his opponent up. Joey's looking to time that uppercut and land it like he did earlier in the fight. Joy with... Oh, he caught him with a big punch! Now he's looking to finish! Back and forth battle! Hard jab! Nasty combinations here. Got him in his guard. That connected. He's back up. Troy with a nice kick. Gilbert Melendez is running out of time, Joe. He needs to do something dynamic to win this fight. He needs something dramatic to happen, either a KO or he's got to finish by submission. He's not going to win a decision. And he's going to try to take the back. And he's got his back here. And there it is. Finally gets that takedown. He's going to go. Get him off, Get him off. He moves to the Mount of Crucifix. This is ugly. Excellent movement on the ground here. Constantly moving, constantly staying busy. Now they tangle. Joe, both fighters need to pick it up a bit. Not much going on. This is certainly a low here. Both guys are countering each other and not moving at all. Total stalemate. Back up again. He tags him with the punch. Man, he has landed so much damage that both of his eyes have started to swell now. Nice hook. You want to talk about fighting to the finish? How about Gilbert Melendez, Diego Sanchez? In this might even be better. Really good movement on the ground. Oh, oh big right hand. That right hand. Oh, big shot. Oh, that's it. It's and over. He's out. Over. Oh. Nasty ground and pound KO. Let's check out the action on our fight replay. And let's look at the replay and see the end of this fight. This is the huge ground and pound strike that lands for the KO. Let's see that from another angle. Check it out here. And he's out. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop to this contest at 4 minutes, 29 seconds of round number 3. He played the winner by knockout, the Korean Super Bowl, Du Ho Choi. Du Ho Choi wins by knockout.